and Dustin. I'm the Toy Hoarder, and today we have an ultimate mystery box. This is probably the biggest mystery box I think you can buy, and it is an entire pallet full of toys that are flushed from nearby stores. So we are super stoked to get this out and get this together. It is crazy hot out because we do live in a southern state, so we are going to try to do this as quickly as possible before we melt. Ready for this? Yep. Okay guys, the first thing that we were super excited about because we can kind of see some stuff sticking out of the box is that we have a Bo Peep in here, you guys. This is the Toy Story Signature Collection Bo Peep. We are super, super stoked about this because this is actually one that I didn't have yet. So later I will get a video up on this for you guys, but I will set it aside for now. And there's actually, there's two in here. You want to put that yep, on the side? Oh my goodness, what is this giant thing? Oh my god, is that a moon? Massive Monster Mayhem Massive Moon Battle Ball. This is a giant inflatable moon ball. This is super cool. It's pretty heavy, actually, so... I don't know, I'm gonna set it outside of the totes. We set up a bunch of different totes so that we can Got a distribute this. What is hex this? Hex bug playset. Oh my gosh, okay, so I don't want to drop any of these bugs. Um, okay, there's a couple little hex bug dudes in here. I'll just kind of set them on this table here. And some little car. Alright, here is a Hexbug Battle Arena. I'm not sure if all the pieces are in here, but there's a whole bunch of different little things and a little hammer for one of these cars. And here's another one of the little cars. So this should be super fun. Excited to play with that. Alright, I have a purple fuzzy boot. That's very exciting. I hope the other one's in here. I don't really know. It's from Rocket Dog. Gator Golf. Oh yeah. I always want to push these. I feel like they're buttons, but they're actually not. But this is one of those old-fashioned games that they actually remade, so that's pretty cool. What is this? Ooh, this is a My Hero Academia... Uh, what is it? What are they called? Domes. Domes. So that is pretty fun. Oh, we got some more snow markers. This is exciting. We live in a place where it very rarely snows and does and not snow very often. to use a snow marker. Yeah, so that's really... Ooh! Here's an Anna hairpiece and bow. I will probably totally wear this in a Frozen toy video later for you guys because that sounds super fun. Ooh, monster trucks. This one is a Zebra Hot Wheels car. Pretty cool. Got another one of these ninja dudes. This is from, I believe, a YouTube channel, but he's super cute and, uh, I don't know, excited, I think. <laughs> we have truck a wheels bag and a of control. wheels and a controller, so hopefully we'll find the rest of this bad boy. Oh, good Atama! It is, <gasps> it's a bacon one! Eggs and bacon! That's so cool. Good Atama's pretty fun. I haven't watched the show yet, but... Ooh, we got a pop. It is Ant-Man and the Wasp, Janet Van Dyne. So a little hard to see because there's a sticker on it, but there she is. We got something called a Yellies, which is like a little purple bunny. Um, it's not very soft here, but you yell at it, and the louder you yell at it, the more it does, or the faster it goes. Um, that sounds like a really annoying toy. I would not get that for my children. Check this out, guys. We got bunny ears. All right, guys, we got a snorkel. It looks like one of those intensive ones, but I don't know a whole lot about snorkels, so. Looks like it could be a fun time. We do have a pool, so. Oh yeah! One of these little flingy pet toys. We gotta play with this at the park. It's gonna be fun. All right, we got a Ralph Breaks the Internet Power Pack set. I should do a video on this for you guys soon, too. This is a pretty cool one, and I actually don't have it yet. <gasps> a snail! Okay, so this is one of those little desk nightlight things. It needs to get batteries, but it's kind of a squishy snail, so that's pretty cute. Oh, we got some finger puppets. Guys, I love finger puppets, and I've got a little niece who's super into these, so these are going to be a blast. There's also a ton of these finger puppets in here, you There's guys. Some, some different ones. Ooh, here's bigger finger puppets. Those are pretty cute. 
All right, I'm just gonna take out some of these extra finger puppets and kind of toss them into bins nearby me because there are a bunch, you guys. Ooh, cool. Okay, so we did a smaller mystery tote and we found the pack of money that goes with this game. So I'm really excited that we have the launcher now. So we should be able to actually play this whole Monopoly cash grab, Monopoly cash grab games. That'll be fun. Pillow fort, castle canopy. Oh, this is super cool. I love forts, you guys. Excellent inspiration playtime. All right, we got a Star Wars DJ here. Pretty cool little figure. Oh, there we go. Oh, here's the rest of the Gator Golf. Sorry, I guess Actually, we got part of it. Actually, I think that's a different one. In... This is a different, different suit. It might... Yeah, this one's still uh, sealed up. So here's the rest of the Gator Golf game that it's supposed to come with. I don't know. We might have like a one and a half Gator Golf game now. Oh, a puppy mermaid? That's interesting. <laughs> it's from Nick Jr., so I don't know what show uh, that's what from. If that you guys show? know, put Bubble that in guppies. the comments. Bubble guppies? Bubble guppies. Oh I think that's God. what that's from. That sounds obnoxious. My uh, nieces watch it, so. All right, we got some pogs. cats. We have some pogs, folks. Pogs. We are back in the 90s, guys. <laughs> oh, here's another one of the cats. And here's a couple more. Oh, these are little bitty packs of them. Okay. Whoa. Oh, I thought I was going to dump that upside down. Ooh, we got Laser Pegs Heroes. It looks like light up uh, knockoff Legos or something. That's pretty fun stuff. I like it. I like it. Oh, no. This got super squished, you guys. It's deflated, but it was a Rapunzel ball. We might be able to re-inflate it, but it's got Rapunzel and Pascal in his little dress. Oh, you so, love this. That's cute. We got a uh, puzzle cloth. Stow and go puzzle mat. It's got the felt puzzle and then a little inflatable piece inside. Excellent oh, for puzzles. We're puppets. getting a puzzle video up for you guys soon. Ooh, okay. A tread pack for the Cosmo. This is a little bitty robot, a uh, little smart robot that you can control with your phone. There's a picture of him. He's super cute. I actually do not have one of those. I thought about getting one. Now I feel like I should have gotten one because now I have treads for it. <laughs> little squishy kitty cat with a mermaid tail. Okay, this is a cute little guy. Oh, I have a niece who's gonna love this. Let's check out this super cute little snail. Then you, you press the top and the balls kind of jump around inside there. That's pretty neat. We got a little Dalmatian with a heart. Looks like one of those Mardi Gras throws, but still pretty cute. This is, oh my goodness, got a sticker on her. There. Uh, this is Anna from Frozen. It's a little Sum Sum or Sum Sum plush. I'm not sure how you pronounce that. I don't think I anybody knows how to pronounce it. it. <laughs> oh, he's a little Olaf hugging a heart, and he's got some little sparkles on him. He's a tie beanie. Super cute. Here's some more finger puppets. Finger puppets, finger puppets. Finger puppets. Finger puppets. Okay, guys. Ooh, there's a Forky. It looks like someone stepped on his face, poor baby, but he is a little change purse, which is super cute. Open him up and you can, all right, well, not a whole lot of room in him, but you can maybe put, I don't know, three coins in there. <laughs> and you can clip him to your backpack. So that's adorable. I love Toy Story, so that's going to be fun. This is... This one Oh. So this is a... It looks like a narwhal finger, or hand puppet. A narwhal hand puppet. So that's pretty cool. Aww, this is the eagle. Um, Mighty Eagle from, I was going to say from Zootopia, from Angry Birds. <laughs> Pretty cute. He's another Tsum Tsum. Got some more Pogs. Some baby Pogs. Oh, snap. What the heck is that? Oh, it's a Walking Dead gun? That's yep. cool. This is Andrea's rifle from The Walking Dead. I don't remember her having this bright red and orange rifle but i guess it's still pretty cool there's a bunch of comic pictures all on the side of it so that's super neat 
Ooh, we've got a, oh, I'm <laughs> open on the bottom here, but it's a felt role play kit. It's got some jelly donuts, it looks like, and uh, some other kitchen utensils and a little stove, so that's super cute. We have a DC Bombshells Deluxe Collector Box. Pretty neat. I don't know what all comes in here. I guess it shows on the back some different stuff that's in here. And it is still sealed, so that will be a fun thing to open up later. We might do a video of that for you guys. Woo! Yay! Toy Story stuff! Alright, this is a Toy Story 4. Looks like a little, like, activity kit. Got some markers, a pencil, a bunch of stickers. Looks like somebody... Oh, one of the stickers came off. That's not good. But a little, little notepad in here. Super cute. I love me some Toy Story. We got another Janet Van Dyne pop. <laughs> Alright, this is kind of ridiculous. We have bunny heads and butts that you can make little, uh, I guess a little cake mold or something. Yeah, it's a little cake mold. You'll make little cake sandwiches out of them. Oh, that is super weird, you guys. Uh, what is a beaver, maybe? Yes, Here's a really creepy looking beaver toy. I forget what they, what do they call the things with the eyes? Like this? I have Isn't no there a name clue. For it? There's like different ones. It was made strangely. I'm not super happy with it. It's a little plush bunny. Ooh, Toy Story! We got some Toy Story 4 uh, parachuting green army men. All right, this says, hi, I'm Frilly. It's a little hairbrush, and I think it's a playset inside of it. Little pick-me-pop thing. Oh, I'm sorry, it's a pop-pop hair surprise. And there's some different hair items and accessories inside of it. That's actually kind of cute packaging. I like You're that. You're going to love it if it actually has. All right, we got some laser set. tag. Uh, looks like chess pieces. So hopefully we'll have the weapons in here, too, and we can play with that little later. This is neat. Alright, we got a coaching clipboard here. Instead of actually putting the paper on, this is a dry erase board and you can mark all the positions on the court or field. That's pretty cool. Oh, we got a little baby bear. Oh, he does play music. Unfortunately, he Oh, I thought that was something else stuck to it. He does play music, unfortunately his batteries are dead right now, so I'll have to change out his batteries, but super cute, super soft, little baby toy. A bear with little stars hanging off of him, and then there's stars on the bottom of him too. Maybe he has an on-off. Oh, he lights up! That's super cute. So you hang this uh, from the little one's crib. Super cute, guys. Okay, this is a Leapfrog Rocket Twist game pack. I'm not sure exactly what this is, but there's some kind of electronic Leapfrog game in here, and maybe there's a little toy inside the egg, too. I'm not entirely sure. I haven't played much with the Leapfrog games yet. Here's another one of those hand puppets. This one looks like the purple unicorn. Pretty cool. We got a Squeezimals Freeze and Squeeze. Looks like a little board game. Yep, it's a little board game here, but I think it's missing the little plush dude. He's probably in here somewhere, but cute little thing. Oh, great. Alright, so this is a for real toy, and while I do like most of the for reals, I'm not a big fan of the poop lots and the pee lots I don't really understand those type of toys, but this is one of the poop lots dog things. It looks like it's got a leash as well. I don't know. I am kind of hesitant to touch it too much, to be honest. We got some more pogs, and some little ones too. Oh man, what is this? Oh, this is like a, um, a little game thing. So this is from Fisher Price. It's one of these little dinosaur game things, and you put the little plastic ball in here, and it'll jump up on the trampolines and jump on the top of it and come out through his mouth and his tail. Super cute little game. All right, this is a Plops toy. It looks like it Barf slime. That is super gross. I'm not super stoked about that one. Oh, I love bubbles. Who doesn't love bubbles, right? Here's a bubble gun. That's pretty fun. Oh, we got matching pairs. It's a little book of all different matching pairs like peanut butter and jelly. Looks like we've got some bacon and eggs, popcorn and soda, that sort of thing. So that's a super cute. Oh, 
Why little penguin? I think this is the same guy we got in the other little mystery box too, huh? I think so, yeah. Super cute. He's very, very soft. I like him a lot. Oh yeah, we got some Incredibles toys. Here's Mr. and Mrs. Incredibles. This is from the Incredibles 2. And these are little action figures. Here's another cake bakery set. We've got a fingerling here. It looks like a little dragon. That's so cute. We need a purple and green one for the toy hoarder. That would be super awesome. But this is a pretty cute little toy. I think they talk and coo at you or do other things, but I don't know too much about the fingerlings, to be honest. All right, here's a board game. Fantastic Gymnastics Vault Challenge. This is pretty cool. Looks like you gotta flip the little doll over the... Uh, you gotta flip the doll on the gymnastics board off and then make her stand, I guess. Here's Mama. another Fortnite uh, loot pinata. I like this guy. I think he's super cute. I don't play Fortnite, but I do like the pinata, and I've seen him on all sorts of different merchandising, so... Aww. Alright, we got a little Paw Patrol set of knee pads and little gloves, or there might be elbow pads and little gloves. Or maybe they came with elbow pads and knee pads and the little gloves. I'm not really sure, but I'm missing a couple in here. All right, we got some coloring books in here. This is a Nick Jr. Top Wing coloring book. Super cute. I have not seen the show, but it looks adorable. Here's a Camp Rock coloring book. All right, got a couple more coloring books in here. We've got a Shopkins coloring book. I love these little foods with eyes. Super cute. Make me super hungry though, so it's difficult for me to collect those. And we got a high school musical coloring book. Oh, here we go. Here's some actual colors. It's a little designer doodle set with a shark on it. Sunglasses. Comes with some coloring pages and some crayons and some little sequins and things. Alright. We got a Mer Creatures coloring book. Adorable. Oh, wait. Oh, man. We got a comic book. Here's a Batman the Caped Crusader. Harbor Invasion. Okay. I love this guy. They sell toys of this right now at stores, and I totally need to get one, you guys. And when I do, I'll definitely post a video for you all. Alright. Got this very fluffy bunny. It's super soft. Oh! <gasps> A Fortnite burger. I like this guy. I think it's, what's his name? Like Meathead or something? Burger Boss? I don't know, but it's cute. Alright, we got a bear. Pretty standard little teddy bear. Nice and soft, but nothing too fancy about him. This is a heavy one. Oh my goodness. He's sort of a beanie type thing, but... Is that Melissa and Doug? Or Manhattan Toys? It's a Woolies Brown Manhattan Toys little puppy. Super, super soft, but heavy. His feet are really heavy. His legs, each of his legs are filled with beans. Very strange beanie. This guy's got some beans in his bottom, a little unicorn. Again, super fuzzy and soft. I love plush toys, you guys. I have too many. Oh, the Misery Index. I think we found a couple of uh, cards from one of these games in another set, but this one is actually sealed, so we can play that later. Oh, yes! Okay, I love these little nightlight things. Here's a frog one, like kind of like a snail. He's real squishy, which is kind of odd, to be honest, but I... No, nope, his batteries are dead. Oh, here we go. We got a Nerf dart. I feel like this goes to one of those rocket launcher things. Maybe. I don't know if that's in here or not, but that's neat. Here's a bubble gun. I think it is missing a piece, but we have the full one elsewhere, so that'll be pretty neat. Another pog set. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, I love these. Okay, so I told you I have a love of finger puppets, and this is a little finger puppet theater, you guys. It's got two different scenes on either side and some little pockets to store your felt finger puppets. That is adorable. I love it. Here's a Star Wars Force Link starter set. This actually activates several different Star Wars toys, and they're pretty cool. I actually might have some toys that are supposed to be activated by this, so... If I do, the, I'll get a video. Uh, the Millennium Falcon that goes with these. Oh, that's awesome. Here's another Force Link toy. Alright, we 
right, we got, looks like Applejack in here. Little My Little Pony toy. I'm not really a big fan of the ones that have the real hair. <gasps> we got a Ba Ba Bubbles sheep game. And I don't know why, you guys, but I think this is like the cutest thing ever. Maybe because I really love Toy Story and Bo Peep and Bo Peep sheep. So this is really fun. This game looks like a total mess, though. I mean, I don't know how you play with this and not make an enormous mess. This whole thing starts shooting bubbles out of its whole odd... It, I would not give it to my small children. This is a cute, super cute little watering can with a shark jumping out. I like it. I'm keeping that. I love it. Oh, a bunny. I feel like it looks like uh, the last Mimsy toy or something. Some kind of definitely children's toy and there's some gray stitching to look like it's actually sewn in. So. That's a super cute one. It's a baby toy. Oh, he's got a button on his butt. Aw. All right, let's do this massive thing. All right. I'm gonna need help. Okay, hold on. Oh, it's not as heavy as I thought it was gonna be. Look at this thing. It's too big for the camera. Look at this insanely huge monster truck. Um, okay. This thing is crazy cool. This is like a $100 remote control toy. It is amazing and it should run on water. So if we get the remote for this, we will definitely do a video for you because I definitely want to play. This is so, so, so cool. All right, here's a Lego snow speeder. Super cute little bag of Legos. Not too much to that, but I do love some Legos. So here's a baby float. Looks like a purple penguin. Kind of cute, a little bizarre because it of the way it's designed, but it does need that sun canopy and everything to protect the little one. Oh my. Jumbo Squishos. Do-it-yourself stress toys. This sounds a little bit dangerous and I feel like it might be filled with slime or something and I'm kind of nervous about this to be honest. Oh yeah! Okay, I've been wanting this game, I won't lie and uh, probably definitely doing a video of this because I mean, look at these giant inflatable burritos that are in here. This is gonna be so fun. I can't even function. Okay, here's the rest of it. If you guys were curious, super awesome. Definitely getting a video of that up at some point. Here's another Incredibles pack of Mr. and Mrs. Incredible. Another force link. Oh yes, some snow markers because that will be really useful for, you know, summertime in the south. Here's some Nerf darts. I think pack we'll go with the, uh, the gun that we got. I do not know. Oh, this is neat. <clears throat> Alright, so here's some restickable food stickers. This is actually kind of fun, maybe for scrapbooking or toy mods or different play sets or something. They have some really cool little stickers in here. I'm, I'm excited to open that. Might be keeping that and playing with it. You know how I get. We got a color your own poster. It's actually kind of fun because this looks like it'll end up being a whole playset where you can take Hot Wheels and run it along the road or whatever type of cars. Oh, look how big it is. Look at this. Oh, that's huge. Um, so this is going to be super cool. We might actually make this. I think it would be super fun and probably add some Toy Story characters in because you know me. Oh, yes. Okay. So. You can use these probably as sand buckets to make monster feet, but this is actually made where you take the string around it and you put one foot on each one underneath this little loop and then you stomp around in it like a little monster. I mean, this is for smaller children. I will probably break them if I use them, but they are so, so cute. And I kind of wish that they were sturdy enough for me. Ah! Oop, got some more pogs here. Oh, guys, this is super awesome. Check out this Star Wars book. It is a Thumb War set, and there are different scenes in here. You, you, uh, you stick the lightsaber on your thumb, and then battle with the next person, and you can do it in all of the different scenes of the book. This is actually super crazily fun, and I might need to save it. It's kind of awesome. Okay, this looks like it got stepped on. I might be able to clean it up some, but it is a little unicorn hairbrush. It's a plush that is an actual little brush, so that is really cute. I've seen these at stores before and considered them, but, you know, me and my lack of hair here, I don't really need a brush, so. 
I haven't purchased it. We got some more Cosmo wheels or treads, I guess, colored treads. These look like pool skinnies. Yeah, they're swimways toys. You kind of frisbee them across the pool. I hope they inflate when they get water in them. Ah, uh, this is super cool. They feel kind of strange, almost gooey. It's kind of exciting. We got some more Toy Story Army Men and another light up unicorn pin. Now you can have one too. Ooh, some more squishies. It's actually a slightly different color green than the other one. All right, this looks like another pink unicorn hand puppet. We got a mermaid unicorn glitter puzzle, you guys. This is insane. I'm probably not playing with that because I am not a glitter fan. All right, this is, it looks like a little farm puzzle. Little bitty wooden pieces, super cute. Ooh, we got a Disney princess book. This is the princess songs from around the world. That's actually kind of neat. I like these little song books. This is probably to our other gator golf game. All right, we got another board game. This one's called Suspicion. It looks like maybe an advanced version of Clue, but I actually don't know anything about it. I will have to check out a ton of board games. And I really have been wanting to get more board games and puzzles on the channel. So if you're interested in that, do write down in the comments that you're interested. And if we get enough interest, we will put more board games up on how to play and the contents of the games. So let me know. I do have Toy Story 4 Kerplunk up right now, and I'm getting a puzzle up for you guys too. So let me know what you want to see. All right, we got some, looks like maybe like model magic Crayola stuff or something. It's from Play Visions. The bag is not a toy, but whatever's in it is some kind of toy of something I don't really know. It feels pretty gross. I don't know what to tell you guys about that one. We got another snow marker, so that's pretty fun. Always useful things, especially here. Oh good, another barfing slime fuzzy thing. Okay, but it's a fuzzy toy, and as soon as it gets slime on it, then it's gonna be ruined. But the whole thing is full of slime. Like, who invented this? I don't know, you guys. They didn't think it all the way through. I guess the idea is then it's a mess and then you have to buy a new one? I, I don't know. All right, here's an ooey gooey craft set. Ew, it looks like you make snowman poop out of this. That's lovely, little poop slime stuff for Frozen today, right? We got another unicorn puppet. And another pooping thing, or a uh, barfing thing, a little, little slime purple dude. Alright, here's a ball that goes in the little triceratops that we showed earlier. Sorry, my ball was rolling away. Okay, here we got some knockoff Legos here, the uh, Block Tech Amusement Park Ice Cream Vendor. So definitely going to build that and put that in my Toy Story 4 Carnival set, because that needs to go there. Ooh, this looks like a pool toy. Alright, so you... They pull this end out, and then it's a water escorter. He's got little heart glasses on, little unicorn zebra horse thing. Not really sure. I guess it doesn't have a horn. It's got a mohawk, so. And it's striped, so maybe it's a zebra one. That's cool. All right, we got a Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse toy. This is Gwen, the female Spider-Man version, which she was super awesome in this movie. I love this movie. I'm a big fan of animated movies, so I've seen... Probably most of them, even some of the really kitty ones, you guys. Okay, we've got another DJ from Star Wars, and we've got Sergeant Jin Urso. Super cool. What's this? Oh, all right. So this is a little Bakugan dragon thing that then rolls up into a little sphere and battles or something. I, I don't really know you guys, but it's kind of fun looking. <laughs> I love these. Okay, so this is a wooden push puppet of Robin. You push the button on the bottom and the whole thing collapses. I love these. Super, super fun. I didn't know they still made these. I didn't know they still made push puppets either. That's kind of cool. Oh, here's a little creature with no arms. That's super creepy and it doesn't look like it's broken. It looks like it was actually made to have no arms, so. I don't know, it could be a bear, a mouse, a, I, mean, I don't really, 
I don't really know, you guys. All right, we got a book, Ready, Set, Learn, First Concepts. A, B, star, blue, small, big. Oh, this is, this is pretty, pretty legit. And then there's uh, rewards charts and some different, you know, learning things in here. Pretty cool for some of the smaller ones. Oh, yes, because who doesn't need a giant, squishy hoop? All right, we got another board game. I love board games. This one is Blowfish Blow Up. I guess maybe you see how... Oh, you have to get stuff out around the bowl before the blowfish touches you, it looks like. I don't know. It looks kind of fun, though. I am kind of excited to play. I won't lie. I love trying all sorts of games, even some of the ones for a lot smaller of kids. But, you know, fun is fun. All right. This looks like one of those little drink koozies, and you can inflate it into a donut with a little bite taken out of. And then it'll float in the pool, and you can have a little can of soda or whatever you're drinking in it, or a little water bottle, or... I don't know, that was pretty cute. Got another board game. Well, actually, I guess technically card game. It's called the Vinyl Countdown Card Game. Oh, actually got a couple of the vinyl card games in here. We can play all the games at all the times. Oh, okay, so this is a little set of some wooden puzzle tool pieces, it looks like. Kind of cute. Anyway, we got this little purple dog here with really fluffy ears and hair, I guess, and tail. Kind of an interesting thing. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, this looks like an alien that goes with... Oh, yeah, it's from Over the Moon. This goes with the little... Uh, robot dude we have. Oh wow, he, he goes on for some time here, huh? There you go. Okay, well that's pretty cool. I like him. Oh, we got two! Ha ha ha! All the aliens. Sweet. We got a wrestler. I don't know who this is. Oh, here we go. Dean Ambrose. I don't get too into wrestling, so I don't know. Maybe it'll mean something more to you guys, but here's this little wrestler character. We got another Janet Van Dyne pop. Yes! Finger puppets! I'm so sad that we only got one. I'm just kidding, you guys. <laughs> but seriously, we have a lot of finger puppets now. It's kind of going to be a thing. It's kind of cute. You uh, start to learn how to make the letters of the alphabet. The kid can kind of trace them with the stick inside of each of the letters. So that's fun. Got a little gray bunny here. Cute, cute. Oh, yes! A magical fairy wand. This almost looks like something from Frozen. I'm not sure if it's actually officially related to anything, but... You know, one of those bippity boppity boop things, which is actually Cinderella, but that's okay. Get a little plush. It looks like Anger's hair. A little plush fire here. Alright, we got the Pie Face Cannon! I mean, who didn't see this game and totally need to play it when it was in the store, right? Guess Who game? I didn't know they were remaking this game, but this is a High School Reunion edition. I believe High School Reunion is sort of like High School Musical, but it's like a live-action TV show that, that they made. So. I don't know. This is a Hasbro game. Could be pretty fun, even though I don't follow High School Musical. Oh yeah, I got a Space Crusader of the Block Tech. Another little snail lamp. His batteries are probably dead. This is a Squeezekins. It's sort of like Shopkins, but they're squishy, I guess. Ooh, oh, they're kind of like rubbery and oh, I don't think I like them, but we have that. Probably a popular little girl toy right now. Oh, we can make little snowball hearts. Super cute. Marvel Sum Sum. Looks like a female 
Spider-Man person, but it's not Gwen. It's, uh, what, what do you say her I name I think is? it's Scarlet Spider. Scarlet Spider. I don't know enough about the Marvel comic series to know her yet. And this, I haven't seen her movie. Does she have a movie out yet? No. Okay, well, that's probably why I don't know her. I haven't read the comic books. Got a cute little Moana plush. Really well detailed. I like that. I'm a pretty big Disney fan. Got a little pet hairbrush here with a little finger thing you can hold. I guess if you have a smaller hand, maybe your whole hand fits in here. I'm not sure how little of kids play with that. Ooh, we got a, a Walking Dead Michonne pop. That's cool. My sister is a super huge fan. She will like that a lot. Got some goggles. A plush chick or duck that is sleeping. Kind of cute. Got another plush in here. Oh, it's like a rainbow Mickey and it's a it's a slow rise squish dude. So that's pretty fun. And here's another pooping shark guy, except uh, I'm not going to pull the slime out of him, but he poops some different rainbow slime you can kind of see in here. Ooh. Oh. Okay guys, I'm pretty sure I'm living like every kid's dream. I am in a giant box of toys with the toys. Anyway, got a little bit too deep here and we could not reach any more, so I'm down here playing with the toys. Anyway, I got a little Bakugan guy. Looks like a little three-headed dragon. Pretty cool stuff here, guys. He, again, rolls up into a little sphere. We got a little chick in an egg with blue polka dots. Some model magic clay. A ninja keychain. Ooh, little plush guy. Oh yes, another one of these change purses. Oh, now you can have one too. <laughs> little Ooh. pencil bag change purse with glitter and a pink tiger. Pretty cool. We have this pineapple. It is. It looks. It looks like a broken bubble machine. Um, bubble machine. I think it's missing a little wand piece. Hopefully, it's in there somewhere. All right, we got a little Shucky's jewelry making set. A small bunny with an Easter egg on his tummy. This super awesome Star Wars Stormtrooper mask. Aww. Oh no, my bow. All right, I got some more model magic in here. We got a Die Hard Christmas t-shirt in a box. Cool. So it comes with the pop and the t-shirt. Pretty cool stuff. We got uh, Sven's carrot from the large Sven character. I do not actually have that toy because I have nowhere to put that toy. Otherwise, I totally would have that toy, you guys. Just a saying. I got this little unicorn fluffy keychain. It's actually kind of a decently nice one. I could see an adult putting this on their purse. All right, we got a little Sesame Street bath book. Super cute. Little plush squishy book. Got another... Han Solo. No, I think it's Hans from Frozen. Another VTech toy. Ooh, some different finger puppets, guys. And some more of the same finger puppets. Some pogs. Some more model magic. Oh, yes, another snow marker. All right, we got another... Hans from Frozen, some some. We got another Kristoff from Frozen. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know if we had a Kristoff from Frozen, but we got two of them in here. Here's a a plush pineapple guy, and he ah. It's a hedgehog. He... No, it's a it's a pineapple log. I'm oh, sorry, that sounds stupid. Pineapple hog. Yeah, that well that works. Anyway. A little pineapple hedgehog who turns into, it looks like, another pineapple. Oh, he's scented. Oh my. Oh, he smells very strongly of pineapple. <laughs> mm. Okay, we got uh, Lego Kitty, the angry one, um, keychain plush. This is my favorite character. He always thinks it's a pink kitten, but like, come on, guys, I don't pink. They're, they're all the same cat. Look, 
It's different when it's angry. It's a whole other cat. <laughs> Alright, I got this. I got this wild animal, a 13 count wooden puzzle. Got a little plush ice cream cone. Again, a decently nice keychain that an adult would hang on their purse and would still look nice. We got some Beyblade stuff. Beyblade Burst Turbo. No idea. Ooh, we got some kinetic sand stuff. Pretty fun. Little fox sand. We got a giant pill case. Just one week, guys. One week and it's all glittery. It's kind of fun. Maybe I'll put little toys in it or something. Got another Kristoff. Zoom, zoom. Got some felt money. Super educational toy. Very fun. I actually really loved playing with the fake money when I was a kid. Okay, maybe I still do. Don't judge me. Okay, I got some more model magic. <gasps> I got some tiny Stenna shit. Oh, wow. Okay, these... They're a little bit, um, I got some smudges. I can't see a thing, you guys. They're very scratched up and smudged, but they're super cute little Minnie Mouse ones. Got a little ball from Franklin, which I thought would be super squishy, but it's actually a fairly solid ball. Here's another Incredibles toy and another vinyl board game. Some more sand, another spider. What did you say her name was? I think it's a Scarlet, Scarlet Spider. Scarlet Spider, Marvel Sum Sum. Dude, this is a Star Wars guy. I don't know his name. I don't know either. Um, but he's adorable. He's from um, the Solo movie. I have not seen that movie yet. We got a Princess Leia lip smacker. Some more pogs. OMG, it's awesome. It says so right here on the box, so it's got to be great. It is fluffy, glitzy bracelets. Cut it, shape it, make it. It's awesome. OMG. Oh, we got a little Maui Tsum Tsum. That's actually pretty cute. A little dart gun. Stick this to somebody's forehead. Here, get over here. Alright, we got a little plush, fuzzy unicorn dude that's spotted. Oh, we got a Horton. Here's a Who Beanie. I love Dr. Seuss. What is y'all's favorite Dr. Seuss book? I think mine is Oh, The Places You'll Go. What about you? You got one? Oh, um, probably uh, um, Sam I Am. Green Eggs and Ham. By the way, the Netflix show is fantastic. I love it. Here's some more Pogs. More Pogs. A little bunny canvas that you can decorate and paint yourself. It's got some stencils in it too to add some extra decoration. We got a whole bunch of these night lights. Little ladybug ones and another snail. Alright, I got some Crayola glitter glue type stuff and some model magic. Some more pogs, some puzzle cards. Oh, I like these. Okay, so these are Shopkins Little Secrets. They're basically like a Polly Pocket type thing, but they come in a little locket. And they come with a key. I am going to get a video up of those for you guys. I do have a whole bunch. Another snow thing. There's a little remote control for something. Here's a Swellamol's Orb Oddities, which reminds me a little bit of like Squishimals or something. You inflate it, uh, you inflate it, and then it gets to this big spherical looking thing, and then I guess you can kind of toss it around to each other. Here's another unicorn hand puppet. Got a tiny magnifying glass in here. Not really sure what that goes to. This is a Justice League figure old key ring. Alright, a couple more of these Tsum Tsums. We got Darth Vader and we got the Bull Sergeant from Zootopia, whose name I forget right now. If you know, put it in the comments. Squishy unicorn that's rainbow and stars. Oh snap guys, we got a box of crayons and 
a cotton candy bath bomb. These are supposed to be really fun. I might do a video of one just because they're really fun to watch. Ooh. Okay, so this is one of those slow rise squishies that's a little cake with a strawberry on it, and you can actually color it yourself, which is pretty neat. Bucket. Stackable trash cans. Look like a little Oscar the Grouch thing. Super cute little stackable trash cans. Yes, snow markers. Yes, more finger puppets. More Toy Story! This is an Imagining Puppy Dog Pals. I do not know anything about this show, but it's basically a no-mess coloring book. Unfortunately, you only get one marker to color it with, and then it turns out whatever color it's supposed to be, so... Those weren't as fun for me when I was younger, and even now, so... Oh, here's another ooey gooey craft kit where you can make some frozen slime. Oh, guys, this is like a straight... 90s toy, 80s, 90s toy here. We got some make your own scrunchies here. More pogs. Game of Thrones epic box of collector nonsense. This is actually a Target exclusive, which is pretty cool. That's heavy. Okay. Here is a build and play market kit. It looks like you can make the whole stand and then little foods and things that you can sell. It's actually a pretty cute little fort thing for kids. It's fairly heavy, you guys. Like, this is, they weren't playing around. I think we got some metal bowls in here. Check this out. Oh, wow. Yeah. All right, we got another one of these uh, barking plush things. He barks slime, which is super gross. Here's this cute little kitty cat. What is this from? This is a Squeezimals. Oh, I wonder if this is a Squeezimals from the game. Ooh, we got a, uh, is this a Fortnite toy? Yeah, this is a Fortnite fox. Got some Crayola Model Magic. Got a little green ball with some swirls on it. It's a PD shirt. The vinyl cards from that card game. This is a Squishy Otter. Look how cute he is. Aww. Another tiger pencil case with some glitter mushies. A stationary kit with bunnies. Because everybody loves bunnies, right? We got a Let's Play Leapfrog book here. Some more Toy Story. Woo! I'll fall over. The Alphabet Felt book. There's some of the pages that are inside. Alright, we got some more finger puppets. We got some Dr. Seuss blocks. Little dice blocks. It looks like you can do, play a little game with the. Here's a Clever Connect puzzle. Looks like little pixel together puzzles. Oh, by the way, I've got a little stool in here so you can still see me in the box. Down here. Over here. Me. Still down here. Okay, anyway. If I sit on the actual floor of the box, you can't see me at all, you guys. This is a huge box. Okay, I got another leapfrog game. Here is a here is a Passover food playset. This is a ready to robot slime weapons. You load the weapon you load the weapons with slime and then I guess fight other robots. I'm not really sure on that one, you guys. Got a few more finger puppets because we were lacking. Some more pogs and another unicorn uh, hand puppet. Oh, a Nerf gun mag. Oh, here we go. Here's the whole toy of the Passover plate. And you put the little different foods on it. And I think it's got some, uh, what, what language is this? Hebrew. Yiddish. Some uh, Yiddish or something in here. You can learn some different languages. Pretty educational toy. Got a Mickey Mouse Hot Cocoa Squishy. That I can't reach it. Squishy. My Little Pony Little Notebook. Oh, it's actually an activity book. Okay, cool. I thought it was a blank notebook, but it's actually a little activity book. Back here. 
here's a pretty large Mickey Mouse coloring book, guys. And stickers. Oh, wow. A ton of stickers. Oh, it's a giant sticker activity book. That's actually pretty cool. I might be keeping that one. Alright, um, got another force band from Star Wars. Here's a fizzy necklace activity. I guess you put it in the bath and it fizzes out and then you can make little charms on a necklace or bracelet. This is pretty cool. We got a big giant uh, sequin covered pen. And it's purple. I love purple. Purple is my favorite. What is it? your favorite color? Put it down in the comments below. Alright, we got Guess Who and Clue mashup game. This sounds super fun, you guys. I've never even heard of this or seen this in any of the stores, but I'm kind of excited about it. And look, Rope is one of the characters. That's fantastic. Here's another Passover plate, and we got, all right, we got the cheetah guy from Zootopia, who's the desk worker and loves eating donuts. I can't remember what his name is. I really need to watch, I need to rewatch Zootopia because I'm starting to forget all the characters' names, and it's really bad, you guys. We've got a wooden roleplay firefighter set. This is super cool, and I might use it in one of my videos just for fun. Oh my. Here's a mess-free Crayola set, sort of, uh, I guess you use water or digital to use some painting or something. I'm not entirely sure, but that looks super fun. We'll have to play with that. Another snow marker and a Passover plate. Squishy turtle with some spikes on his arms and his back. I have no idea on that one. It's, oh, it's a drop dot. I don't really like it very much, but there's that little guy. <laughs> Sorry, it's a squirt gun that goes in the end of a pool noodle. I don't know if it'll still work. We got a lipstick playset. It looks like it's got some squishy toys in it. Sugar lip gloss. Cheeky boutique pick me pop. magic and some snow marker all right we got oh this is one of those blooming doll things oh she's not in here there's a couple little surprises still in here so there's a little person here and there's a couple little surprises in there all right let's see what the other surprises are <gasps> oh i think it's a character you guys oh i can't get it out my fingers are too big it's a little popsicle guy. Can you hold this closer to the camera, please? Sure. Here we go. Oh, my. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so I've got a little skirt, a little shirt, a little ruffly shirt, and some little sandals. I'm going to have Dustin show this up a little closer. Show that handbag, too. That's super cute. Here's the inside of the bloom house, and hopefully you find the little bloom doll in here. They usually look like they've got a big foam thing on their heads that's made of gems or something. Alright, here is the rest of the box to the Triceratops game and some more pieces to it. So the good news is we do have the whole thing. It's Alright, some more snow stuff. Oh, here's a white one, guys. Unless it's just missing the cap. It's just missing the cap. Oh, I got excited. I thought it was a different one. Some more Toy Story toys. Another unicorn hand puppet. Ooh, here's a dinosaur hand puppet. That's kind of fun. We haven't seen that one. Here. Another narwhal, it looks like. Some more snow hearts. Oh, I missed. A force link. Here's a pink unicorn. Thick and glossy, stretchy, slime, gooey stuff. Kind of fun. Kind of messy, but kind of fun. Here's another Toy Story thing and another Hans from Frozen. Oh, here's a different package of uh, the cats. Hogs. Hogs. I'm going to call them cops. 
here is a Fortnite bunny that is one of those squishy slow rise dudes. Here is an egg of bunnies. It's kind of like the barrel of monkeys, but it's little bunnies. Kind of hard to see in here. All right, this little fuzzy thing is called Lexi, and she's got oh, she's got snap bracelet arms. That's super cute, but it's not very soft. It's kind of a rough texture, so I don't know, and I'm not sure what animal she is either. Here is a magic cube puzzle. Looks like a bunch of arctic animals, which is pretty neat. They've got several other ones. It's like a lion and an alligator and some other things too. So this is pretty neat. It's eight magnetic cubes and you can make them into different puzzles. Or maybe that you can make this same one into the it's lion and the alligator too. I'm not really sure. Or maybe just arctic animals. I don't know. Mm, this one's a whale, a polar bear, and a penguin. Cool. We got some red legos. Ooh, here's another dinosaur hand puppet. Here's a balloon, a bee balloon. It's just real like that. I feel like I should make a bad bee pun here because that's what you should do on YouTube, right? Has anyone seen Wreck-It Ralph 2? All right, we got some doodats. It's a little beaded Egyptian cat. Super cute. More pogs. Got a Game of Thrones mystery figure. What's inside? It? What's inside? What's inside? A mystery bag. But what's inside the bag? You guys are so it's lucky. Empty. Mysteries within mysteries. Oh god. Well, I'm trying. It's a wolf. Okay, I kind of like that. Ooh. So this is from a Netflix show called Super Monsters, this little wand that lights up, it looks like. It's a spelling magic wand. Oh, I hope it talks and teaches you how to spell and stuff. That's super cool. There's no battery in it right now, so I can't show you guys what it does. Okay, guys. Um, here's this green plastic tray thing that's fairly solid, not very bendable. Oh no, looks like some sort of really small child sled or something, maybe a piece of a sandbox. I don't know, if you guys know, put that down in the comments below because I have no idea what that is. More pogs! And a little golden book. This one is Scuffy the Tugboat. Here's a Paw Patrol Imagine Ink coloring book, a fuzzy kitty keychain, a little tiger or something it looks like. Here's another connecting puzzle. And one more. Here's a different Dr. Seuss block set. It looks like you can put together the, the different body and head pieces of the characters and feet. So that's pretty neat. Here's a little game of wooden blocks, um, different numbers and addition, subtraction. Learning maths is fun. Here's another Incredibles toy and Toy Story toy. Another one of these clipping slime things or vomiting slime things. Ooh, guys, another bath bomb. This one's a cherry scented one. I gotta do a video on bath bombs. I think that'd be really fun. Let me know if you guys would want to see that. Set. Here's a Crayola Mess Free Baby Shark set. Super fun. Do, 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 do. Here's a Frozen Olaf uh, Magic Ink Coloring Book. Ooh, a Mickey Squishy. This one looks like an ice cream sandwich, and I love ice cream sandwiches, so that's a super dangerous one to have, you guys. Look at these eggs. I don't know if they actually look, no, they're squishies. They're little squishy toys, but they look like egg-shaped uh, Easter characters. They're actually really cute. There's a, a chick, a lamb, a bunny, and a chicken. So, super cute little dudes. We've got some Dr. Seuss door cover decor. 
for your classroom. It says this classroom is full of wonderful things and then you put the little thing where you put the name of the child. Pretty neat. Here's some cat toys randomly. Ooh, some more Dr. Seuss blocks. Ooh, a slingshot. A puppy dance party book. Oh, wait, look at this, guys. Guys, guys, it's one of those. Oh, it, rubble ones. is really jamming out there. That's cool. Problem is, kids will play with the cover the whole time and not read the book. That's just you. All right, we've got 20 pogs and a bunch more of these glitter glue things from Crayola. Get ready, stickers! This is actually a school zone, so this is probably a pretty educational little sticker activity book. Here's another one of the finger puppet sets. This one looks like it's fairies. Open it up so you can see the oh, yep, there's a little pictures there are. Fairy over here, too. And it comes with the little finger puppets, too. I like it. Here's Elsa, little uh, mini Funko Pop. Is it a keychain? No, I think it's just a Funko Mini. Okay. No, it's a Pocket Pop keychain. Oh, okay, nice. Another fairy set. Light up any project. Oh, this is cool. You can put little LED lights on your school projects and things, and little DIYs. I am you know, looking toy for mods. something like this for um, a toy mod that we're doing. So. Nice. Um, got a. What is this? Here's a PJ Masks slime kit, it looks like. It's called Sticky Splat. Maybe it's like Silly Putty or Slime. Got a number four with Kiwis. It's got these little flowers on the back. I think it's probably from the Sheep game. My Wi Fi just disconnected. Here's a Marble Tsum Tsum. Uh, a Marble Tsum Tsum key ring. Here's a chapter book called Tessa's Lost and Found. I don't know anything about this series, but it looks kind of cool, actually. Here's another chapter book for The Lion Guard. Oh! Okay, this is called Unicorn and Yeti Sparkly New Friends. Or Sparkle New Friends, I'm sure, because there's a sticker over it. But that is so cute, you guys. Here is a unicorn luggage tag. Ooh, a little rubber stamp set with some inks and things in it. It's a, an Easter one. Oh snap, glow in the dark silly string. Guys, this is gonna make an epic video. Just saying, just saying. Here's a plush rainbow llama toy. Slightly cute, slightly creepy. One of those. He's another one of those big sparkly eye dudes. It's a little raccoon, but he's a, a ball, a little squishy. And unfortunately covered ball. in slime. Poor guy. Here is a scoreboard for a game called Say Anything. Hopefully we'll find the rest of that game later. Another one of those pooping plush things. Or barking plush things. Here's another marble keychain. Oh, here's some wooden kebabs, you guys. That's actually a super fun toy. I like that. Got a little mouse that is a car, a little mouse and an umbrella holding a sunflower, and the wheels of the car are little buttons, so that's super cute. Here is a green and blue water gun. Kind of fun. And the last thing we have is this book. It is from Wreck-It Ralph, but it has a bunch of different stickers of the Comfy Princesses and a ton of other stuff. As you guys know, I love the Comfy Princesses. And eventually, I promise you guys, I'm going to get all the videos up of every single Comfy Princess doll because I have every single one, but I'm working on it. I'll get there, I promise. Anyway, this is super fun and cool. I'm very excited about this. I never saw this in stores or I would have probably bought it. All right, that is everything, guys. Let me know what you guys thought of this video or if there's anything we should do different for the next one because guess what? We've got a second pallet of toys. Another giant box full of toys plus tons more totes. So 
a lot, a lot of stuff that you guys have got to see because it's gonna be awesome. Plus I really wanna see what's inside. So I'm gonna get those videos up for you guys super soon. But go check out the channel for plenty more toy reviews and have a great time playing. We'll catch Bye. you next time. Bye.